After swapping out my bank for last month's Deadman tournament, I was poor. Very poor. In fact, I had 13 mil cash and enough toggle for an onyx to my name. So I bought an onyx, sold an onyx, bought an AGS, and decided to go PKing in search of some riches. I was finding this guy up at Lava Maze and no one died, so we decided to rematch in Edgeville. First PK so far, Dragon Crossbow, 500k cash, and some enchanted robes, that's around 4.5 mil already. Was up at 44 as we saw another Brit and we instantly attacked them. What? I just PK'd a Staff of Dead, this guy was risking his Staff! I had no idea, I thought he was just a big noob, I wasn't even talking or anything. But uh, that's a free kill I guess. I didn't even realize it, but a normal Staff of the Dead is only worth 4.6 mil now. That's kind of disappointing. The kill is only worth 6 mil. Alright, well that's another kill. Uh, heavy Ballista as well. A lot of shit. Almost 2 mil. Now before we carry on with this video, a quick word from the sponsor of today's video, Raycon. A big thank you to Raycon for sponsoring this video. Raycon are my favorite earbuds. They come in the small case and never fall out of my ears. The company was co-founded by Ray J and the boy Snoop Dogg is obsessed with them. And what can I say? I got a lot of inspiration from the boy Snoop. The earbuds start at half the price of any other premium wireless earbuds on the market and they sound just as amazing as any other top audio brands you know. They're great from working from home, working out, or just listening to music and podcasts. Their everyday E25 earbuds are their best model yet, with six hours of playtime, seamless Bluetooth pairing, more bass, and a more compact design, as well as multiple color options. So if you guys are interested, click the link in the description box below, or go to buyraycon.com slash in order to get 15% off your order. Once again, a big thank you to Raycon for sponsoring this video. Good fight, 6311 for the KO, that's gonna be a lot of loot. Oh my god, is there a B-Ring in there? I can't see one yet, but Blessed Spirit Shield, Dragon Crossbow, nah, he's using a Reek. How much loot is that? 5.8 mil, very, very nice. Dead? Come on, one more bolt? He's actually dead. 40 for the KO, I risked that hard and we got him. He drops the lol, but that is a big ass kill for everything. That was such a close fight, I was risking that because I knew I could get him if I got that. Big ass kill, everything. Let's pick that all up, GG. And how much loot is that? I'm expecting over 20 mil. 18.75 mil, not 20 mil, but still a very nice kill. B ring instead of the Brimstone ring. And that is another big kill for us, staffed a lot. Okay, I do actually know that guy, he's been flaming me the past couple days, so I'm happy to sit him down really quickly. And the loot total is 15.7 mil, staff of the dead, occult, stuff like that, very nice. So I was finding this guy up at 44s when this other bird came up and started flaming me. So I instantly asked him if he wanted the tribrid stake, which is basically just an outlast fight in the duel arena. And it's guaranteed outcome, it's either a win or a loss, and you either lose money or you make money, so I was down to do it with this guy who seemed to think he was better than me. 
First try bridge take, just a nice little 10 mil on his world where I have 200 ping. First 10 mil acquired, and we're going for a rematch. We're we have so much food left and he's out. Oh, this is bad. That should be the KO right there. And that is another 10 mil in our bag. Nice. At this point, I asked him for a rematch because I was down to keep making more money off of him, but he didn't want to do any more. Oh, the 3073. Was he protecting item? He wasn't. I just picked it a crossbow. What the fuck? I'll take it. How much is that worth? 8 mil! Awesome! Good fight! We got him with the anti-stack. 65 AGS. Let's pick that all up. Good fight. Alright, and how much loot is that? 1.9, almost 2 mil kill. Very nice. He had a rune pickaxe. So I was doing some tribrid stakes with my friend Abyss, who's a streamer on Twitch. Very competent tribrid. I won a couple, he had won a couple, and it come down to a deciding tiebreaker, which was going to be a 60 mil tribrid stake. Now, if I lost this, my cash stack was going to go to 500k. And we managed to edge the victory and get ourselves 60 mil from a tribrid stake with Abyss. Good fight. This guy attacked me up at 44s and was risking a staff of the dead on the dragon crossbow, so obviously we're gonna go for it. We weren't really saving, so neither was he, and we managed to get him with the whack and get ourselves 12.5 mil loot. Alright, we were trying to fight some other guy who was in risk, but um, he's not here, so we're gonna go for this guy instead. 102 combat, we should hit like a truck like him, I'm gonna chuck up a smite, in case I can go for a smite. Nice. Oh my god, he's almost dead to the barrage. Did my fight just come- oh my god, this guy just died to a 12 vault. Jesus, I guess he drank a restore or something. I was looking around to see what happened, and that's a kill, let's pick it all up. Alright, and how much loot was that? One mil. Oh my god, it's the guy who I literally just killed like 20 minutes ago. He's risking again, I just have to pause the Abyssal Arrow stream because I gotta focus up for this kill. Is he dead to a barrage? Is he dead to a bolt? Damn. Those are some real- that was a really good start to the fight. We're hitting mad numbers right now. I wish I had my Black Dead Chaps instead of the Dark's Legs. That would make this a little bit easier to get the kill, I feel like. He's already playing melee there. Oh, there you go. 
He's praying Mel here a lot more after he's died to me, so it's gonna be a lot harder to get this kill. Hey, just you more? Oh, 0 30. 31 there. Can't die to that. Praying melee, nice. Risk it for the biscuit. 31 for the KO through the prayer. I think that might be my max whack. He's gonna be upset at that. That's another kill on the same guy. A lot harder this time. He was definitely looking out for it, but we still got him. GG. All right, another kill on the same guy. 10.5 mil. Very nice. So some more tribrid stakes. I was going in for a 10 mil versus this guy. First 10 mil one with quite a bit of food left, and we went in for another 9 mil. Won our second fight for that 9 mil as well, and we moved on to try root stake in someone else. Went in for a 10 mil with this guy. Won the first 10 mil, which he wasn't very happy about, so he went for a rematch on his ping world. Mashed to get him with a 54 AGS whack for another 10 mil, and at this point, he didn't want to do any rematches. Abyss was live and keen for a deep wilderness fight. I was in Mystics, he was in Arams, but I was still down to do a quick fight. All right, and that's a best for Max. Let's pick it all up. GG, man. That's a big kill right there. AGS'd a lot. Let's pick that all up. GG, man. All right, 76 AGS for the kill there. I'm expecting this to be like close to 50 mil, maybe like 40 mil. 
38 mil, still very nice. AGS, staff, the log, good fight to Abyss, respect for the fight, man. So I didn't end up dying or losing money tribe staking while recording this video, but my luck didn't carry on as I PK for fun, as you can see here. Anyway, still ended up profiting 222 mil from that 13 mil on Onyx we had at the start. One of my best videos yet, so please show some support in the form of a like or a comment as it does help out a ton. And make sure you are subscribed so if you are new, you never miss a new upload. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you later.